Psalms 130, A Song of Degrees. Out of the depths have I cried unto you, O Lord. Depths, you know, when troubles overwhelm you. You feel like you're drowning. Uh, literally, when Jonah. But there are times when troubles just feels like you're just drowning. Lord, hear my voice. Let thy ears be attentive to the voice of my supplications. Troubles and problems, and you want God to hear you. He does hear you. It's not that God doesn't hear. It's not that God is asleep like Elijah was mocking the prophets of Baal. It's sometimes God is patient and long-suffering. We want everything now. And sometimes now would be to our hurt. If thou, Lord, shouldest mark his iniquities, O Lord, who shall stand? Now, you leave that verse right there. Every man will be marked, for none have sinned, and for none has done right. None is good. For all have sinned come to short of the glory of God. There is none righteous, no, not one. That means everybody would, would die and go to hell. But verse 4, but, and that's a good Bible, but. You know, doctor will say, I, I looked at your test, everything looks good, but then comes the bad news. But there is forgiveness with thee that thou may be as feared. So God forgives our iniquities when you do what God tells you to do. That is our hope, and that is our joy, that thou mayest be feared. Listen, a man who, who is not forgiven of God does not fear God. He doesn't care. He's not cleansed. I wait for the Lord. <clears throat> that means, out of death have I cried unto thee, O Lord. Lord, hear my voice. That means i got to wait for the Lord. And there's coming a day when the Lord will take care of all troubles and all problems. And in his word do I hope. That's the only thing you got is word. You got the promises word. You got the prophecies of the Lord Jesus Christ all fulfilled in the first advent. There's yet the second advent. There's yet the church age to come to an end with the rapture. Yet the Jacob's trouble and then the word of promise. That Jesus Christ did fulfill all, and he will fulfill all. My soul waiteth for the Lord more than they that which that watch for the morning. You know, to, to start their day. There are people lying in bed, oh, I can't wait to get going, you know. I say more than they that watch for the morning. The morning in the Bible is the Lord Jesus Christ. But the morning to people is to start their day to go make money, to go do what they want to do, to go fishing, to go do things. Let Israel hope in the Lord. For with, for with the Lord there is mercy, and with him is plentiful redemption. God's not willing that any should perish. And he shall redeem Israel from all his iniquities. And that's going to happen. There's going to be a time when God will look upon Israel and not see what they have done.